My special guest today is Lisa Gottlieb. Lisa Gottlieb is known as the e-commerce queen of Denmark, and she's also the creator of Power Ecom Formula. As a marketing expert, entrepreneur, best-selling author, speaker, and coach, Lisa shares her proven strategies with self-motivated, disciplined, hardworking people to help them attain a holistic lifestyle that includes personal and financial independence. Lisa's 43 books, over 300 articles, business coaching, and health and diet products stem from her true life story. After successful sales careers at Oracle and Deloitte Touche, she developed a thyroid disease, which inspired her to write a self-help book on the topic to help others facing health challenges. Her latest works include PowerEcomFormula.com, AwesomePaleoDiet.com, and you can find her at LisaGottlieb.com. Welcome, Lisa. It's so great to have you here. Thank you very much, Heather. So that's the power marketing or the power product. Yeah. And around the power product, do you like a lot of entrepreneurs have many different products? They might have different coaching programs. They might have different online um, online programs and courses. And brick and mortar is going to have more than one product. Yeah. What are what are the indicators of what is your power product? Um, I will say that if you are uh, selling physical goods online, yeah. I will teach them how to do analysis and find out what products are the best selling products mm -hmm. online. Mm -hmm. And we will copy from the best in the world. Yeah. And I will teach them how to find them yeah. and how to copy them, how to source it and how to handle it. So that is a part of what I do with, with uh, how I succeed with the e-commerce clients. Mm -hmm. But if we talk about a client, uh, a customer with, um, who are selling uh, services, I will help them to bundle these into some more simple packages mm -hmm. so the customer doesn't get confused. Mm -hmm. And uh, maybe if you want to take them in one direction and you give them a, an offer, you might have f a, 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 some variation of that offers in different price range, mm -hmm. but still something like the same. Mm -hmm. If you can, if it, if I should go, give an example, it could be that if you learn, le want to learn Facebook advertising, I can sell you a packet for, for $5,000. And somebody will be uh, th uh, will move backwards and say that's too expensive. Mm -hmm. So I will give them another offer where I can teach them to f do Facebook ads for maybe two hundred dollar. Mm -hmm. So th that is what I mean. So then you position yourself as the Facebook advertising is, uh, expert, but uh, you have different programs. Right, and that's all about branding too. It's really positioning yourself and yeah. being known for one thing yeah one thing fu fundamentally and then yeah. you know i always talk about branding as having the trunk of the tree you have to get the tree in the roots and yeah. after you have the tree in the roots yeah. then you put the branches on and yeah. i think a lot of people get that shiny object syndrome where they're like i'm yeah. going to do this and i'm going to do this and then you confuse your audience yes and it's not as it doesn't yeah. flow like from what you're saying yeah then the profits don't flow. Yeah, I totally agree, 100%. Yes. Yeah, so yeah. you've worked in a lot of different places. Yes. And you, I think you told me you're in Dubai? Dubai? Yeah. Yeah, so yeah. what do you do there? What, who are your clients there? Yeah, I don't do it anymore. Oh, okay. But uh, I have, um, uh, have had investment company mm -hmm. where we created investment funds and we did some in Dubai. Oh, nice. Yeah. Nice, and you do some work in the United States as well? Yes, I have clients here as well. And where, where do you work, in Boston or? Um... No, I, because I work online, so they can actually be from everywhere. Oh, okay. And when I do marketing, I do it all over the United States. That's right. So, but I know that, uh, uh, that um, uh, some places, um, United States is, um, more used to e-commerce and mm -hmm. to buy things online than, than other English-speaking countries. So uh, it's a very uh, nice market for me to uh, work with because uh, I know that the clients there, they are very keen on e-commerce. Mm -hmm.